smoothie time in the kitchen. A mundane domestic moment is anything but for the women of Dismiss Home. I am a felon. It was a DWI one time. She did two years in state prison. Now at 68 is trying to rebuild her life. Finding a place to live is often the biggest hurdle. Sarah saved my life. Seriously. This is Sarah Lutat, the executive director of Dismiss Home in Manchester, one of the slim resources for women transitioning out of the correction system. We require that if you're going to choose this program, you're going to do the work. And the work is the hardest thing that they've ever done. Intensive therapy, dredging up painful memories, working on sobriety, being accountable. Dismiss Home isn't a crash pad for unemployed ex-cons. It's a launch pad for women who want to find independence and success, who never want to go back here. I made one mistake, and I'm paying for it for the rest of my life now. I should be able to get into some kind of facility that is going to help me, but you can't because of that stigma. Lutat is pushing state legislators to fund more programs like Dismiss Home for Women and is critical of the uptick of so-called sober houses in the city of Manchester. Amy Cavino, WMUR News 9.